Hi Billy Planners, welcome to today's video. I am super duper excited because I have here a lime and mortar package that I received on Friday and I was super keen. I'm sorry, I've had a sneak look. <laughs> Um, already opened the package, <laughs> but I did it in the dark, so I couldn't film until today. Um, but yeah, I'll still be excited about it because I super duper am. It comes in this gorgeous, gorgeous bag um, with all these spots, and it says lime and mortar on the side here. And um, yes, I have a lime and mortar planner. Comment below which design you think it might be or have a guess in your head right now which one I would have got in. I also grabbed um, one of the ruler markers and some stickers as well. So I will show you those as well. So we'll open it up. Okay. Which one do you think it is? <laughs> Did you guess right? I'll just grab everything out. Did you guess right? Yes, the stickers. Okay. Should I put that up there? So yes, I have a lime and water planner. This is like my first ever one, by the way. And I'm just going to set my camera up a bit better. Okay. And this is the gorgeous design. We will run through that in a moment. I also grabbed some stickers and a this week marker as well. And this is the gorgeous postcard. These are all the designs. I know that the daisy one sold out and this one's close to selling out. Um, but I decided to go this one. <laughs> and then this is a thank you from the lovely Leanne. And thank you to you, Leanne, for my first ever Lime and Mortar Planner. <laughs> so I grabbed a This Week marker to pop in there. Um, I always like having markers in my planners so you can just quickly flip to things so that's a special one for this planner and before we look at the gorgeous planner let's have a look at the stickers i decided to get um the sticker kits for each of the designs of the planners for the um for the yeah, that Leanne did. And there's this as a freebie. And a thank you. I am going to have to, next time I order from Lime and Water, ask for a loyalty card because I don't have the current one. So, um, yeah, <laughs> I'm just stating that so that I remember. And this jumps my memory. Or you guys can remind me. So yeah, for each design, I got the lime kits for them um, because the stickers are gorgeous. And then the, I thought that would give me something to start with for the planner and also, um, you know, something of each beautiful design. So this one's the ink design one. I was so close to getting this one because I love purple and pink and the aqua ray blue colour. I was super close. <laughs> um, so yeah, this is page one of the stickers. So you get some decorative boxes, checklist payday, a circle, a mandala, stick note and a box, weekend banner and a long checklist. And then on the second page, you get this week to do list, weekly tracker, habit trackers, like washy ones, a box, a sticky note box, which is cute, a bigger circle, and then these three little boxes, and another checklist. 
and then I've got the daisy one as well which is super gorgeous I do plan a lot with florals um, so I decided not to get that actual planner <laughs> I did I show you the second page of that my apologies <laughs> And then there's the um, bouquet one, which is the planner that I got. Super bright and colourful. And then there's the leaf design one too. I'm not sure what that was called. But yeah, I wanted to make sure that I grabbed all of those. Let's pop these back in the pocket. And then we'll have a look at the planner. Isn't the package gorgeous too? <laughs> so, once I put these in, we will have a look at the planner. Okay. Isn't she beautiful? <laughs> so, this is my first ever flame and water planner and i will explain during the video um walk through like why i got it um and yeah so um this is a quill planner i haven't had a quill planner in a very long time since i had my air condren um but it's a nice black quill and it feels pretty strong and then you get some hollow on the cover where it says Lime and Water in 2023. And then you get your gorgeous design on the front and the back, which also says Lime and Water on there with the website if you want to go and buy one. <laughs> um, okay, so inside you've just got like a black back ground and then you've got this card here which is about the artist step um who did the cover for this so I'll just pop that with my other one um let me just set this up awesome for you yep so the first page says this planner belongs to um, and then it says Lime and Water 2023 Weekly Planner down the bottom. Lots of spots. Then you've got a login and password page. Um, which I probably will just cover up with stickers or something different because of my goal for this planner. Um, and then we have a year in pixels. I haven't done a year in pixels in a very long time, so it will be nice to get back to it. Just wondering. So we have our year in pixels. Then the year ahead. Um, but generously, I don't use this style very much. Um, but yeah, we may do with the, um, aim of this plan, which I should probably mention actually right now, hey, before we get into things. So I bought this Lime and Water planner with the intention of it being a health planner, um, just to record everything about my health, because currently everything in that regard is like everywhere it's like on bits of paper notebooks it's in like my main planner it's in my my journaling system it's just everywhere <laughs> so next year i wanted something so that i could have it like all together in the one system um so yeah because i've got a lot going on with my health um, and there will be for forever, that kind of thing. 
So I wanted something where I could just have it all together in the one place so I knew where to find things for a start and um, get more into also recording everything for my health as well because um, yeah it's a bit hit and miss this year and in past years so that is my goal with this planner um <clears throat> excuse me don't know why i went croaky this is like a goals page and has like blank boxes um i probably will have a goal um looks like there's 12 so you could have like each month set um which is what i'll probably do there and then this page here is for each month set up um however um you can always change the title of birthdays and put you know a different title which i will probably do for the aim of my planner then we have the month which has like a tab you've got a tab for each year months and then first of all you have a monthly spread um you've got a focus box and line section down the side and then of course your dated month um i will use monthly definitely for what i intend to do um in that part i'll probably put like appointments coming up um and yeah some other things i'll sort of track in there and things like that as well and then this bit you've got like january and then you've got like all the dates so in here um i'm just thinking off the top of my head because i haven't really planned for this page yet i'm still sort of contemplating things but i might in here put like um like how i felt each day maybe or um it could be like my pain tracker or something like that um as well then there's like a goals part down the bottom here you could easily make the box something else and then you have like a monthly checklist which is handy because i can put in there like you know book a doctor's appointment or book a psychologist appointment or um whatever i need to do for my health um and then this is the weekly page so on this side you've got each day of the week which is dated and some lines to write on so in there i'll just quickly say what i did for my health or if i couldn't do anything and i was stuck in bed that day i would simply write stuck in bed couldn't move or something like that which happens trust me happens a lot of days um and then on this side you've got some boxes where I'll probably put like something decorative to be honest like the kids <laughs> um you've got a have a tracker section up here for three items so um depending on what I want to focus on the three focuses um so it could be like vitamins tablets um hydrotherapy or exercising or whatever um and then there's a bit of a to-do list so i can take that from like my monthly one put put what i need to do for that week there and then there's a weekly tracker so i could do use that for whatever i don't put in the habits um could yeah if i'm focusing on diet or something like that i could put what i eat or whatever in there um yeah so each week is the same i'll just zoom out a little bit so you can see it better and i'm gonna position the camera a bit better too so that's better <laughs> 
Yeah, so each week is the same throughout the month. And then at the back, you get some lined pages to write on, which is handy. So if I want to expand on like an appointment I had and write a bunch of stuff down, I can. And then we go into the next month. And they'll all be the same format. So yeah, I'm super keen to have like all my health stuff together, which will be awesome. And then yeah, you just keep flicking month to month. And it is for the full year. I'm just sort of flicking a little bit at a time. <laughs> so we get to December. And then at the back of December, there's actually a note part here. And then you get a bunch of note pages at the end. Some are dotted, some are lined. And there's a fair bit there to jot down and stuff. And I think it's just paper on the back. Oh no, it's a lovely page on the back. And then your back cover. That's what's happening. It's not turning for some reason. Oh, maybe you just have to flick the other way. Okay, so that's the planner. And my um, goal for the planner. I will still be using Happy Planner, like anything. But yeah, I wanted to have all my health stuff together and that's why I got this ladder water planner um yeah like I couldn't see myself using it as a main planner because these bits are super tiny and I need heaps more room than that <laughs> but as um like for my goal it will be fine to use as a fun topic sort of planner um yeah so that's it I might actually put my marker in so that I don't lose it and see how it works too. Okay, I've got it easy to punch in. Did you guys get a new lime and water planner? If so, which one did you get? <laughs> And um, do you plan on using it for like everything that you plan for or um, do you have, are you going to use it for a specific topic like myself? <laughs> Thank you for watching this video guys. I really love this planner. It's gorgeous. Um, and my stickers of course. And I will catch you all very very soon. Bye.